Hey guys, Chris here from Havoc Legion. Looks like Glock just released their Gen 5 17M to the Indianapolis Metro Police Department. And some of the things we found on it on the internet, we found some pictures, we found a lot of information on it, is they're gonna have uh, ambidextrous mag releases, they're gonna have a better finish on them, they're supposed to have a better trigger, much like the G2, uh, G42 and the G43. They also have a flared magwell, which is huge for the competition world, and then the, uh, uh, the finger grooves. The finger grooves are removed, which is more of like a Gen 2 almost. Uh, stay tuned. We got some pictures. They're coming up right now. So here in this picture, you can actually really see that flared magwell, which is super cool. Really good for competitions and everything like that. I think the only people that might not actually like that is the concealed carrier, especially on a 19. That might gouge into your side or however you, you know, kind of carry it. I feel like that, that might be a annoyance factor. Supposedly word on the street is uh, they uh, didn't really want to do that. They fought it, fought it, fought it, but I guess they finally were able to do that. Um, you know, obviously you can see here it's missing a pin, just like the Gen 4s. Then supposedly right here, there's supposed to be a longer uh, return spring assembly, which it I can't really tell from the picture, honestly. But there were some problems with the Gen 4s and stuff like that, things slapping and stuff like that. And I guess I've seen a few pictures where it's cracking along this area. Um, but I've never seen it in person, so I can't really tell you. Obviously, up here you can see the 17M. no way to actually see that oblonged um, safety plunger though and obviously this is the the left hand side of the gun so you, you can't tell about the ambidextrous release though um, another thing that they've actually talked about also was uh, there's a different rifling different rifling inside the barrel so what that came about how that came about not really sure um, I don't think there was anything wrong with the previous rifling but you know they probably did some more testing and whatnot and, and figured out something so here you can see pretty easily the uh, ambidextrous slide release which is pretty cool for a lot of left-handed people even though there's about one in ten people that are actually left-handed um, it still makes it a more versatile uh, firearm to use for the masses um, my son shoots left-handed and he has trouble with the mag release a lot of times he's been able to learn how to just uh, seat the magazine with enough force where it'll actually send the slide forward loading uh, the next round in so that's pretty cool that it's just an option there so that's the quick down and dirty of the G17 M edition gen 5 maybe that might be released maybe shot show 2017 with a bunch of different advancements make sure you guys give us a like on the video and then also subscribe to us we're also on twitter facebook instagram and all those social media things we release different things to each one of those uh, social media platforms so add like subscribe to every single one of them you guys will get a little bit different content for each one until then we'll see you guys at the range